everybody. Today we're going to talk about measuring and we're going to use these measuring rules to measure this guitar. So our measuring rules are we start end to end which means we start at one end of the object and we measure all the way to the other end. We don't just measure part of it. Take a look at these blocks. Do they measure from one end of the guitar to the other end? Number two, no gaps or overlaps. That means whatever you're using have to line it up one after the other. If you leave a gap or if you overlap, it won't work. Did I make sure there's no gaps or overlaps? Number three, we measure in a straight line. So when this guitar has a lot of bumps and waves, we have to find a straight line along the side of it to measure. Are they in a straight line? Number four, same units. We have to use the same tools to measure the whole time. So you can't use two different size units at the same time. Did I use the same units the whole time? Now I can count my units to find out how long the guitar is. What if I measure with these instead of these? What do you think will happen? How many red blocks did I use? One, two, three. Why did I only need three red blocks to measure the guitar? when I needed 12 yellow blocks to measure the guitar. Take a look at this blue block. Predict what will happen when I measure the guitar using blue blocks. One, Two, three, four, five, six. The guitar is six blue blocks long. All right, so remember those four measuring rules. We start end to end. We measure with no gaps or overlaps. We measure in a straight line, and we always use the same units when you're measuring one object. Happy measuring.